Hi guys, today let's talk about types of VLANs. Management VLAN. A management VLAN is used to configure the switch for management purpose. It handles system logging and monitoring. By default VLAN 1 is the management VLAN. Data VLAN. The data VLAN is used to divide the network into two groups. One group for user and another for device. Also known as user VLAN. The data VLAN is used exclusively for user generated data. It carries only data traffic and is not used for management or VLAN traffic. Voice VLAN. The voice VLAN is configured to carry voice traffic. Voice VLAN typically have higher transmission priority than most other types of network traffic. A separate voice VLAN is necessary to preserve bandwidth for other applications. Default VLAN. When the switch initially starts up, all switch ports become member of the default VLAN making them all part of the same broadcast domain. A unique feature of default VLAN is that it cannot be renamed or deleted. Native VLAN This VLAN identifies traffic coming from each end of a trunk link. A native VLAN is assigned only to an 802.1Q trunk port, where the trunk port places untaked traffic on the native VLAN.